What's up guys, in this video, you are going to learn how to store photos on Amazon. If you have an Amazon Prime account, you can actually save photos directly to your Amazon account. And the nice thing is you get unlimited photo storage. So it's a good idea, even if you have an iPhone or an Android, to back up all of your photos to Amazon Prime. It's like saving your photos on the cloud so that you can access them later on. You don't have to worry about them being saved to your computer and then your computer crashing or dying. You can just save them directly to your Amazon Prime account. So let me talk about a couple different ways to do that. Let's jump over to amazon.com and I'll show you the simple steps. All right, we're over here on Amazon Prime signed into our account. Now you're just gonna go over here to your account and lists and you're going to select your Amazon photos. Now you might be taken directly to your Amazon photos like you see here on my screen, but you also might be taken to a main screen which will show you how to download Amazon for your desktop or for your iPhone. Let me sign out really quickly and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Right here is where you will probably be taken for the first time. Now if you notice here, you can download a desktop app which kind of looks like Google Drive or iCloud Drive on your Finder if you're on a Mac or just within your documents. And you can click and drag photos directly into that folder or upload, fold or upload photos to that software. But you can also download an app directly to your iPhone or Android. And that way you can save photos directly from your iPhone or Android device to your Amazon Cloud account to have a backup of all your photos. And like you see here, you get unlimited photo storage and five gigabytes of video storage with your Amazon Prime account. This is not extra, this comes with Amazon Prime. But to get back to where I was, I can just click this little sign in button right here. And then I'll just sign in with my Amazon credentials and I can get right to my photo library. Now it's super simple guys. You can organize albums, people, places, and to add photos, you're just gonna click right up here, add, upload folders, and then choose the folders on your computer and then upload them directly to your Amazon Drive. Some other things you can do is you can upload a new folder, you can create a new album, or you can click a link to take you to the desktop app. Now, if your photos are labeled or they're labeled maybe by date, you can search for photos that you have saved to your drive. So if there's a photo that you're looking for, maybe like Halloween a year ago or something, you can search and find those photos. Amazon Photos, guys, it's a really cool free feature for Amazon Prime members. And I think a lot of people don't know about it and they don't utilize it. People are trying to, you know, back up their iPhone photos, they're buying hard drives, they're paying for iCloud storage. When in reality, a lot of people have an Amazon Prime account and you can just use Amazon Prime as your backup for all your photos. So I invite you guys to check out Amazon Prime if you don't already have it. Just another benefit of using Amazon Prime and there's a lot of other benefits that come with it but make sure you're backing up your photos, whether you're using the desktop app, the uh, smartphone apps, or just coming onto amazon.com to do that. It will be a safe way for you to back up your photos in case your device uh, breaks or your computer breaks, you can have a backup. All right guys, if you like this video, remember to hit that thumbs up button. Make sure you're subscribed so you can see all of our upcoming videos. I've got some really cool videos coming out here shortly. So subscribe so you can see all those and share this video with a friend. Maybe you have a mom or dad or parent that has uh, Amazon Prime and they don't know about this and you guys can start backing up your photos. All right guys, thanks again for watching this video. We'll see you next time.